Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have successfully managed to clear the AZ900 Microsoft exam. So I hope you know that AZ900 is the Microsoft certified Azure fundamental exam and which you need to clear. And so I managed to clear it today and I'm going to discuss in this video uh, that how I cleared this exam, uh, what is the exam pattern and how did I prepare for this exam. So if you're interested, do please keep watching this video and definitely don't forget to like my channel, subscribe to my channel and do definitely keep following me. So first let me discuss with you all about the exam pattern. So this exam has 40 to 60 questions. Now it depends on how many questions you are going to get. So ideally there is 40 to 60 question range and for my exam I had 41 questions to be attempted in 45 minutes. So 41 questions, 45 minutes. Now before they exam there is a one small survey taken where you have to so, so basically the exam is divided into six five six uh, sections and before the exam there is a survey which asks you that what is your uh, competency level in each section that whether you have no idea whether you have moderate idea you you are very professional in that so on based on what you select the questions are given so if you say i have no idea then the questions in that section will be a bit easier level so in that way the questions are decided because there is a large number of question pool which they have and from that they uh, allot questions for your exam. So as I mentioned I had 41 uh, exam, 41 questions and for 45 minutes. Now this is conducted on Pearson platform and before the exam begins there is, there is, a, no, there is someone who is going to check everything. So you have to click your pictures of your surroundings like the screen, like the uh, background in front of you, behind you. To the left and right of you and then you will share it with, with uh, someone who is there uh, you know who is moderating the exam and after that the exam is held now the pass mark for this exam is 700 and the maximum marks is 1000 so i received 900 out of 1000 so i passed this uh, exam now this exam is a relative exam like uh, just because there is there is no absolute reading like 41 questions means uh, you answer one question you get this many marks but this is relative grading and relatively I have received 900 out of 1000 so basically your score is scaled to 1000 and that is how you get your final score now let me talk with you how I prepared for the exam so I mainly prepared from two sources first is Microsoft Learn so this is the uh, free online uh, uh, free online course which is available on Microsoft website Microsoft Learn and you are going to get everything in that there are six uh, I guess there are six sections and you're going to get all your uh, final questions from this section only. So, so if you study these six sections, you'll be able to clear this exam. And the second thing which I referred to was this site called examtopics.com. So in this site, all the questions which have appeared in previous, uh, this is a 900 uh, Microsoft certification exams are there. So you can go through this website. I'll, I've mentioned it in the uh, description box below. So you are going to get all the questions over there and there are around 300 to 350 questions and from there the final questions will definitely be one of them. So if you prepare those 345 questions then you are going to definitely get all your questions from there. So that is what I did. I mainly uh, studied from Microsoft Learn and then from uh, I viewed the questions from this uh, examtopics.com. So yeah that is how I prepared for this exam and uh, this exam uh, is a paid exam which is 3700 rupees but I used a voucher from my company and I got it for free so if your company doesn't give any voucher then you have to pay 3700 INR or 100 dollars that is the payment which you need to do and then you are going to immediately after you successfully clear your exam you are going to get the, your certificate immediately now what if you do not manage to clear this exam then you can uh, attempt to retest for this exam after a specified number of days so you can attempt your retest again after registering and payment and all that. So yeah, this is the details which I wanted to share with you all and I'm very happy that I have managed to clear it in my first attempt. So yeah, thank you guys for watching my video and do keep following me for the next uh, content. So thank you guys very much.